Hey y'all, Mrs. E here, and today we are going to check out chapter 6 of our Apex Legends lore for this season. Super excited to go into it. I'm thinking we're probably going to get like Robin in or something. Just because of how last week's episode ended, I'm still a little mad face that they've hurt Jamie. And I'm still betting money. I'm still willing to bet, like, I got a dollar around here somewhere, y'all. I'm willing to bet a dollar that... Revenant doesn't have anything to do with it. But that's just, I don't know, it's just like an odd feeling I'm getting. Uh, but alright y'all, uh, don't forget uh, to hit that like and subscribe button. Turn those notifications way on. We try to cover, like I try to cover any and all Apex Legends lore on the channel with occasionally I'll have a random Overwatch video thrown in there. I actually had a lot of fun making yesterday's Overwatch video and I'm thinking we might do some Overwatch 2 gameplay uh, depending on how all that goes. But alright y'all, uh, yeah, let's jump into it. I'm really excited. Chapter 6, Deal with the Devil Given a choice, I'd never go underground, but sometimes the girls gotta get things done. A creepy-ass bunker under King's Canyon? I can hack it, except... Having simulacrum bodies nearly crush your head every five seconds? I'd rather be in G-Lock. Oh, someone call housekeeping already. Be my guest, little birdie. Maybe they'll get here in time to clean up your corpse. The voice comes from above me. Not the most creative scare tactic, but it's Revenant and his whole murdery shtick is getting pretty tacky. <laughs> what are you, a jack-in-the-box? I thought assassins were supposed to kill their targets. You know... Quietly. Think you're funny, do you? I could slice you clean through before you'd even know what's happening. And Loba. She'd be so, so sad. Sounds like the perfect gift for her. Y'all are obsessed with each other. I, oh, y'all, seriously, like Loba and Revenant, they're just obsessed with each other. I'm over it. I'm so, I'm, I'm just, we're over it. We're over it. <laughs> I whirl to face him. Ugh. And that's the problem. You're obsessed with goading her and she can't stop taking the bait. It's like having a permanent third wheel. Ooh. Valk's got a point, y'all. <laughs> oh, is my involvement with Loba getting in the way of your little romance? Mm. Uh, yeah, it is. You were leaving the Outlands with Sergeant Stick in the mud. And that was supposed to be the end of things, but you just had to keep hanging around. First of all, her name is Bangalore, Valkyrie. I'm gonna need you to respect her name. And second, I mean, why did Revenant stay? That's a good question. That's a good question because Bangalore is still there. So why does, does Revenant need somebody to like hold his hand? He drops down from the ceiling and leans over me, studying my face. Creep. So what? You want to get rid of me? Wouldn't that be a treat? Got 20 years to spare? We could plan a road trip. Keep making jokes, trash can. But I can give you what you want. Huh. You really think you can kill me? Yes. He stops, neck creaking as he turns to face me. That's right, you glorified kettle. I mean business. If you quit playing your stupid games with Loba and leave her alone, I can make it happen. <laughs> I don't buy it. But that desperation? Oh, that's something to live for. I'm not just the third wheel, am I? I'm her priority. <laughs> You're giving yourself way too much credit. <sighs> You're afraid she cares more about killing me than she does about being with you. How all she does is dream of vengeance against me while your heart bleeds. Ooh, Revenant. Bud. Oh. <sighs> Shut it, can Tin Can. You want to die or not? Touched a nerve, did I? Fine, I'll bite. You gonna fetch my head from Gridiron? I don't need to. I know a guy. <laughs> you know a guy? Yeah, and funny thing, he says your head isn't on gridiron at all. What? Touched to nerve, did I? <laughs> you know what, Valk? I see you, Valk. Tell me where my head is right now or I'll wring your puny neck. 
Yeah, you don't want to do that. I'm your only lead. <sighs> Down, boy. I'll happily give you what you want as long as you back off Loba. And that's what Loba wants too? Maybe I should thank her. You'll keep your mouth shut and stay away from her. <laughs> she doesn't know. Oh, little birdie, you make me so proud. You've got yourself a deal, but if you can't deliver, <laughs> don't go thinking you've got me on a leash. I can always cause a little trouble in paradise. I'll see you later, birdie. Or maybe I won't if you hold up your end of the bargain. Y'all, what is this juicy? He climbs off into the darkness of his creepy lair, his laugh reverberating off the walls. I let out a breath, letting the tension leave my body. I start back the way I came. I check my phone and there's a message from Loba saying she's coming over. A smile tugs at my lips as I dial her up, but then... Oh, hi, Valkyrie. Loba's too busy stabilizing her dying friend, Jamie, to come to the phone right now. I have to call for help. Bye! Yo, I was right, y'all! I was right! She was with Revenant! So Jamie wouldn't have been tied up by Revenant. He was in his house! Y'all, she did not just give Revenant a freaking alibi! I love it! I love it! Jamie? What happened to Jamie? But the call's already ended and a jolt of panic races down my spine. My bodysuit suddenly feels stifling. There's only one reason someone would hurt Jamie. The head. I take off down the tunnel, find a patch of open sky, and fire up my jets. This is the only shot we have at saving Loba, and we can't lose it. We can't. Next. Party on, Elliot! Yes! <laughs> Oh no, I'm still, y'all, can we all just say collectively as like, as a group right now, like we're bummed that we didn't get a Pathfinder Vantage chapter. I feel like they need a dedicated chapter or like Apex Twitter video thing. I'm just really bummed. I feel like Pathfinder would have been the perfect person to like walk around with Vantage and be like, this is how you make friends. Um... I just feel like that's a missed opportunity, Apex. Maybe they just haven't done it yet, but it's a missed opportunity. Ooh, and we only have to wait one week, y'all. We only have to make one, make one Yago team. All right, y'all, what did you think about this? How crazy was this? Revenant was is probably not the one that hurt Jamie. <sighs> so that just means that somebody else is after Rev's head. So somebody else knows about it. But also, how crazy is it that Valkyrie will be the one to give Revenant his alibi? And Loba then cannot blame this on him. And I'm pretty sure this means that her and Valkyrie are going to break up. And this way, her and Banglore can get back together. Even though they were not ever officially together to begin with. But I think that maybe they will be better. I don't know. Anywho, what are your thoughts? Let me know down in the comments below. Um, Y'all, I'm super excited. One week, we'll find out. Hopefully, we'll find out a little bit more next week, but you know how it is with these. We never get a full story, and then we won't hear about this for another two or three seasons. Who knows? But uh, all right, y'all. <laughs> don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. Turn those notifications away on, and I will see you all next time. Go team!